So I've bought this uh, high gear slumber camp bed from Go Outdoors and I bought it because it has these three aluminium cross legs which I thought would sit nicely in the boat and the idea is that they feet sit here, here and there. So let's see how it goes. So, as you can see, the feet at the back are on the floor. The one inside in the middle is off the floor. And that's because the front leg is sitting on the centerboard casing and that's what I knew would happen but I figured I could take these legs off without much damage to the uh, bed anyway so I figured it out and this is what I've done so the legs are held on by this rivet so I've just got a 6mm drill bit and drilled through the rivet right through the leg, the arm, to the other side. And then the leg just slides off. the same the other side the leg just slides off here we go so we discard that so these end pieces if you leave it as it is have a risk of coming out and getting lost so what I did was I bought these M6 bolts which I can just put through with a butterfly nut on the other side. Right, so that's just screwed on and that stops that from coming out. And I'll do the same the other side. bed back together. Okay, so this end piece is back on. So now the bed has got one, two legs but the end one is missing and I'll show you how that sits in the boat now so the end and the end the end with the feet missing rather goes to the Four end and then the two feet sit there and at the back. I'll show you that now. The feet at the back sit on the floor here. The middle legs also sit on the floor and then the front arm now we see sits on on the uh, side benches same either side and then underneath is completely clear of the centerboard casing. Now I have got a couple of bungees on my boat here and all I do is I bungee Round the leg on this 
side. The bungee is it's actually fastened on my shroud anchor there. Anyway, so that pulls like this side. And then I go around here. And do centralized there it's supported on the side benches and it's supported on the floor on the middle foot the floor on the back foot and there's my bed and then later on I shall get the boat ready put it on the water and then show you that fitting it while afloat. It's a little bit cramped because once it's up you've only got this side area to move about in but uh, I have used it, it is manageable and it's a comfy night's sleep. So see you on the water. So all this area here is going to be free to put things under so now I'll grab
This has to go up when you've done everything else for the day, when you've cooked your supper uh, and ready for bed. And of course there'll be a tent round it as well when you actually come to use it. So putting it away is equally as awkward. Having those nuts and bolts on the on the end pieces there stops the black from coming off. I think I said that earlier. There you go. And that just tucks. sleeping arrangements for the GP14. So now Yeah. 